We have the TGIN Moisture Rich Sulfate Free Shampoo versus VO5 Sulfate Free. So some, um, a little bit of more information regarding the TGIN. It has coconut oil in it. Amla oil, I believe that's what it's called. No sulfates, parabens, petroleum, mineral oil, artificial colors, or animal testing. Um, this is, I want to say it's around between 10 and 12 bucks, but I will be having the price below in the description box. Next up, we have the O5 Sulfate Free Gentle Cleansing Color Protection. It is paraben free and dye free, 100% Moroccan argan oil. This cost me a little under two bucks. I think it was like 198, 175. So you're gonna see me in the shower um, using both products on my hair, splitting my hair down the middle, okay? So we're gonna start off with the VO5 sulfate free shampoo. And let me first apologize. I'm gonna be referring to this as suave towards the end of the video. I have no idea. Um, I've been using this VO5 shampoo for a while, a couple of months now, and I absolutely love it. It's very, very creamy. The other side I'm gonna use the TGIN. And the TGIN is a lighter consistency, but it is great lather. Um, I also wanna apologize. Look, this is gonna to start to look like a b-rated adult film because i left the door closed and it got real steamy girl real steamy so yeah this is the tgin like i said it's a little bit runnier however great great lather i'm gonna let some of this steam out so that you can really see what my hair looks like with both of these shampoos in okay i am i am so upset i think most of that footage was foggy i'm gonna play it back if it was foggy i would do it again because yeah, I don't mind doing it again. Ryan Little. <laughs> Yoga. So here I am rinsing out both shampoos and yeah my hair felt great with both of the VO5 and TGIN however I did not have to use much of the TGIN shampoo as opposed to with the with the VO5 I felt like I had to use twice as much just to get a great lather my hair also felt softer um, I felt like my curls were more defined with the TGIN, sh TGIN shampoo excuse me now you guys I want to apologize in advance towards the end given my final commentary I keep referring to the VO5 as Suave because I just was looking at some new products that Suave has released now y'all I'm a little too excited about this but Suave has released a new line specifically for coily natural hair. Apparently it's already out um, at CVS and some other stores. I have not been able to find it, but what I have found were two collections by VO5. They have a new detox shampoo and conditioner and also an avocado cream, and I will be reviewing those products by VO5. So anyway, this is what my hair looks like. I'm gonna give my final commentary and heads up like I said. I'm going to keep referring to this as swab even though this is VO5. Okay, you guys? All right, you guys. <laughs> all right. So with it all said and done, I think I have everything out. I can't really see. Girl. Um, I'm going to be honest. It's been a while since I used the TGIN shampoo. I thought the swab had it in the back uh, only because I've been using it and I love the way my hair feels when it goes on. However, the TGIN wins hands down. Yes, it's more expensive by eight, 10 bucks, but it's well worth it. I also found that I didn't have to use as much of the product. So yes, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, girl. I'm having fun, let me tell you. <laughs> All right, you guys, take care, bye. Don't wanna hear me, hear me. Don't wanna be near me, near me.